Hey guys, welcome to another Technical Tuesday. This is Peach Nick. You are watching Mugmits. This little thing here a cattle breeder, a beef aging unit, and an auto meat cooker was my latest, uh, my latest project. It is proving to be rather difficult, actually. I have a couple concepts down, like two out of the three things. One thing works kind of not too bad. This part works perfectly, so this is what we'll, uh, what we'll showcase first. This is the cattle breeder. Now, what this does, this allows cattle to be up top, so the cows can be up there and happy and do their cowy things. And we can go into our handy dandy backpack and feed them wheat. So we feed you guys wheat and the baby cow falls down. Now the reason for this is cows occupy uh, it's it's a little weird. It's a uh, okay. Cows are shaped like shaped like this. That's a cow. Baby cows are shaped like well, kind of like this. No, like this. Kinda. No, they're one block tall. Baby cows are one block tall, so and they kind of have the uh, the same dimension sideways. So cows occupy a full block sideways, like so, but baby cows only occupy this much sideways. Like if this were standing up, if this were the top, this were the, their feet. So the cows can stand on top of this space, which is just shy. It's like one eighth less than than a full uh, a full brick but the baby cows because they're tiny they uh, they just fall right through and you can just run across here feed all your cows burp, 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 burp. and all the baby cows fall down and subsequently escape because I opened a hole <sighs> get back in there Yeah, you want to go in there now? Get in there. Stupid cow. So yeah, this um, this little part works pretty well. Uh, the doors can be open, they can be closed, it doesn't really matter. I, I set it up like this, so the uh, so this side here, uh, I could use uh, the, the bottom bricks, I could try and pipe it into, into this system here. This... I haven't really worked all the bugs out yet. This is a beef aging unit. Ooh, unit. Learn to spell. How to English. So what this does is it keeps all the cattle moving in a circuit. All the constantly moving. There's no dead zones in this circuit. I worked rather exhaustively trying to get it so that there was no space where they'd like get stuck and pile up which happens if you use like a water bucket flowing out a stream and then putting a sign there to stop it from flowing any further and then putting another one getting it to go this empty square it uh, tends to fill up so how this works like I was saying because adult cows are a block and a half tall they can be under here, they can be under here just fine, swimming along, swimming along. Oh, this block here, because it's a full block, there's only one block space underneath. Only baby cows can fit under there. So the baby cows go, oh, underneath here, into this, and then back around the system. So they'll keep on doing that until they become an adult cow. And an adult cow anywhere in the system flows around all the way around to this spot and then hits that full block and then flows out here. So it pipes your, your adult animals into this this section. Um, I was fooling around with a bunch of things, a bunch of different ways that 
people say you can do um, you can kill stuff with fire damage and not have to worry about the uh, the um, the items being destroyed I've I really was not having any luck at all with them um, so the the meat cooking portion of this uh, of this particular experiment I I couldn't get it to work I don't know what it was it, like the uh, the lava blade thing doesn't work um, no, no, let me get that straight like it'll kill them like they do die but the meat doesn't come out cooked more than half the time and having fire having them walk on a block of fire and then be on fire and burning and then die sometimes they die on top of the fire and items get destroyed it was it's it's a problem I have I haven't haven't come up with a solution yet uh, I I will keep working on it and uh, and hopefully be able to uh, be able to finish this to perfection uh, this system is rather large this unit's pretty big uh, you could definitely downsize this quite a bit uh, you kinda have to have four or more sideways flows like corner flows for the uh, for the baby cows to get separated out because it doesn't happen right away like they don't flow right from there to here they kinda struggle to stick to that side and then get sucked out eventually and go around the system again and there's a there's a weird bug where like cows will swim up swim up swim up and then stop underwater and drown so it's it's not it's not perfect um like i said i'm gonna keep working on it and hopefully uh hopefully we'll come up with an answer uh i'll try and uh if i do manage to figure out how to do the uh the auto cookery part of this i will absolutely um post videos for uh for the other animal types the other animal sizes uh the chickens the pigs I don't no horses aren't gonna drop meat that would just be creepy um but yeah they're uh this system works really well keeping your adult breeding stock away from your uh Away from your little baby cows, and then you can you can do whatever you want with these guys. Like you can ship them to a, a different yard or or whatever, and then let them grow up, and then butcher them, and just keep breeding the the top ones. You don't have to worry about accidentally killing off too many cows or whatever. So I know this wasn't uh, wasn't as comprehensive as usual, but if you like this video, leave a like leave a comment definitely tell me what you guys want to see more of uh, tell me some common problems you guys are having in in your minecraft some solutions you want answers I will try my best to uh, to come up with some innovative and clever designs to, uh, to make your minecraft lives a little easier so like comment subscribe and we will see you all next time